Hey guys, welcome. I hope you all had a great 2024 New Year. I got a lot of great gifts for Christmas and I just wanted to show you guys what I got. I went shopping with my dad and I got a couple little things. And so one outfit I actually wore for Christmas Eve. It's this green dress and it's so adorable. It's got like a flowy little bottom and long sleeves. And I think it's like a satiny material, but I love this little middle button detail and it's cinched at the waist so it looks good on my body type. You might have seen it on my Christmas Eve vlogmas, so if you haven't already seen that, go watch it. And I paired it with this adorable little bow. I honestly love the fact that bows are kind of coming in right now. Along with the dress, this bow is from Altered State. And then I also paired it with this necklace, also from Altered State. And I also have this really cute bracelet that's a similar design to this. And my dad was like, oh my gosh, you have to get it and pair it. It will work perfectly. And I was like, let's do it. <laughs> so this next thing is this top from Athleta. Mostly a running top, I guess. But I've been eyeing like a striped running top like this for a while now. Wait, I just realized it's not even black. I think it's like a purple blue indigo -y she color. That's adorable actually. I like it even more. <laughs> Next from Athleta, I just got this basic black tank top. It fits me really well. Like I did upsize this one because this one obviously looks tighter too, but it, it hits right in the perfect spot because I actually have a pretty short torso and so this top is like a perfect length for me, which is so great. It's ribbed, it's so cute. Next, I got this top at American Eagle. They've got a ton of different colors and I've recently found out that like this color, sort of a magenta color and maybe like an emerald green, they look really good with like my hair and my eyes. Like one year, I actually wore a green dress to homecoming and that dress looked so good on me because the color just worked out so well with my personal colors. It actually looks really cute on, I think. And it's good for like layering too, if I really wanted to. And I'm going skiing during spring break. So this might come in handy for that. Okay, next, this was a gift for me. I don't really know where it's from. If we're being honest, it might be from like Nordstrom Rack or something. I could also use this for layering too, which I probably will. And this one is very, very soft and I love it. So I'm kind of into... A lot of band t-shirts and so that is one of the things i asked for predominantly on my wish list and i got a couple of them this one is pink floyd and i think it's really cute i like the colors i actually do have a pink floyd shirt but it's really thin material and it's kind of falling apart there's like a tiny hole in it so this is good to update my pink floyd shirt next is this led zeppelin shirt which is so cool um the material on this is a bit different than that other shirt but i actually really like it and it feels really durable normally i just get a regular t-shirt with like a band cover on it but this one i wasn't really expecting and i already have a deaf leopard shirt but this one is actually so cute and when i tried it on i was kind of scared because it's like one of those baby tees you know but it actually works out pretty well pair it with some jeans and it would be really cute too the next thing i got and I didn't realize that Baylor worker people for games and stuff wear pretty much this exact same design shirt. But I thought it was really cute and it was really soft. So I got this from Altered State. <laughs> and they have it in a navy too. And I ended up getting this in a size extra large. Which is like, what? Like, that's tiny, right? Because the small and the medium, which I normally would probably wear, were like so tiny. And I mean, I get the idea that it's like cropped. But like, I just wanted a cute little sweater, so, and this one fits like pretty well. It is so soft, this material, oh my gosh. Next thing, I got this from American Eagle, and it's just this little cardigan. And I feel like stripes are kind of in right now, I don't really know. And I wanted to get like a black and white striped sweater, but I don't really know if I would wear it that much. And I love cardigans, so I just decided to mash the two up. Okay, the next thing is this white turtleneck. I have a white turtleneck. I got it from this random website, but it's not great quality and it's so short, like cropped, cropped, cropped. So I got this other one from American Eagle, textured rib material. I love it so much that I went back and got another one in black. The white is a large and the black is a medium. I didn't realize I got two different sizes. And after trying them on, I definitely feel like I like the large a little bit better because it is a tighter fitting shirt. Next thing on the list is this adorable shirt. And I've been seeing this pretty frequently online. And I've always kind of second guessed if I needed it because it was like a really tight fitting shirt. And I was like, eh, like I don't really love tight fitting shirts. But then I saw it in store and I was like, ah, might as well try, right? 
So this tank top is from Altered State and it's just like a very textured florally purple top. And let me tell you, it fits very nicely. I mean, it is tight, but I probably won't be wearing this without like a cardigan. And these straps, oh my gosh, I love thick straps. And like, look how stretchy it is. Like, oh my gosh. So the next thing I have is this oversized button down shirt. It kind of looks like a guy's shirt, not gonna lie. Like I could definitely get a guy to wear this, but it's for girls. Hello. And I, I'm so into those cute jeans with like a loose button up and a white tank top. Like that style is kind of beachy and I'm not mad about this beachy vibe. So I also got one in pure white too. I mean, you could just wear it with like colored pants or shorts or something. But I think my main idea was that maybe I could start wearing like sweater vests over them. I think that is so adorable. Oh so cute i also got a little bit of cash for christmas and i've been very into madewell recently and so i had to go and get me some jeans because their jeans are so nice these fit absolutely perfectly and i don't have any really that have these wide legs oh their jeans are just so soft and comfortable and what's so hilarious about this is that i used to hate jeans like you would never catch me wearing jeans unless i was attending like an acquired event where i had to wear them will i start wearing jeans more now i think maybe <laughs> next up i got this little cute cowboy boot that has chocolate covered pecans these will definitely taste pretty good next i actually got two of these things and i was not expecting to get stuff like this at all because normally everyone thinks of me as like a tomboy because that's what i used to be when i grew up but i've been wearing a purse a lot recently and so i got two more <laughs> this one is from dkny and it's cool because it can turn into like a belt bag it's got this little hoop thing on the back and then it also has this to turn into like a crossbody and it's just it's so basic white little purse and i don't know i kind of love it and it, it's kind of more of an outgoing purse mm -hmm. compared to anything else that i have so definitely be using that and then the other purse i got is more of a cute little country purse that i probably would just wear casually it's got some outer pockets and then the inside is pretty spacious and i really like the shape of it and it's got this cute little tassel <laughs> now the next thing i got if you know me i love these things um but it's a blanket <laughs> I literally have a blanket for almost every sports team that I like. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, so it's just a basic white throw blanket, but it's really cozy and it will look good wherever I put it because it's white and it goes with everything. <laughs> okay, next thing. You can't have a Christmas without getting one of these as a gift. So I got this lovely candle and it's eucalyptus rain and it's definitely a candle that I would put in the bathroom because it's a very fresh and showery smell but I really like this. Okay, next thing, I got a toilet plunger. <laughs> it's a water bottle brush. And the only reason why I got this is because I also got a new water bottle and I've actually been wanting these for a while. They're getting really popular right now, but it's so cute, like, oh my gosh. I can't wait to, to drink out of it and clean it. <laughs> okay, this next thing is sort of random, but it's this 100 pass along notes for gratitude. And it's basically just a hundred little pages that you can rip off. And it's basically like a prayer on each one. I am so excited to just put these in random places wherever I go. I love when people do that. Even when I was at Altered State, there was this Christmas card in the changing room and it was literally a bunch of Bible verses. And I was like, this is adorable. Like, I love this idea. And so the fact that I was given this as a gift, like literally the next day is like a sign from God that I need to spread his word and get him out there. Okay, next is actually this necklace that I'm currently wearing. I think it's so cute and I'm definitely gonna be wearing it a lot. Now also, you can't really have a Christmas without candy. <laughs> so I got this chocolate and I haven't even opened it yet, but I am kind of scared because look how high the cocoa percentage is, like 95. That's crazy. The chocolate I eat almost every day <laughs> is probably around like 65 to 70. This is going to be interesting. So you already know about my Apple Band collection and I'm currently at 22 and after Christmas, I am now at 28. <laughs> so I got six of them. So this first one I got is just another leather band, but instead of brown, like I would normally wear, it's a black one. The next one I got is kind of maroony, magenta-y, but this is a really cute color and I'm excited to wear this too. The next one I got, I'm absolutely in love with this color. 
um, but it's this blue turquoisey color and it's oh my gosh it's so cute i'm very very excited to wear this one <laughs> next i got this basic white one however this one is thinner i already have a regular white one but i saw my friend with a thin one one time and i was like wait that is so classy and it looks just so nice but i'm interested to see how this will look compared to the other ones okay next this is another regular size one and it's this purple lavender-y color. Okay, last but not least, this is the sixth one that I got. And this one is actually the Apple brand. It's the Nike Sport Band. It just looks like this. And it's got this like confetti look to it. I didn't really look into it, honestly, because I was just looking how cute it looked. <laughs> but it says on the box that this was made to help reduce waste. So I'm thinking it might have something to do with like recycling or something. Because it's made of completely recycled material. Another thing that I wanted for Christmas were socks. And I was hoping that I would get maybe some nice Nike socks or Puma socks. And before I was able to like put links of the ones that I wanted, my mom was like, socks, that's easy. <laughs> so she got me some Scooby-Doo socks, Barbie socks, <laughs> these fuzzy gray socks. But the kicker, it spells out when words fail, music speaks. <laughs> and the last pair of socks that I got are these goofy, Cocker Spaniel Christmas socks. And the reason why they're Cocker Spaniel is because my dog is a Cocker Spaniel. And so my mom thought it would be funny to get me these goofy little socks. This is the very last gift that I got. And honestly, it's probably my favorite because I've been very, very interested in getting one of these. It is the Ninja Creamy. I am so excited to use this. Oh my gosh. I am a big ice cream person. And this way I can make my own ice cream and I can make it in a way that it can be healthy. So I am genuinely very excited for this. This puppy is gonna be very well used. I'll have you know. <laughs> well, that pretty much concludes my Christmas haul. I hope you guys had a great Christmas and a great New Year's, and I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I got. I'm encouraged by my Christmas gift, so I challenge you to tell someone about Jesus. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Toodles. <laughs> Thank you for watching!